What is up, you? I'm not gonna lie. I ain't doing no intro. Carson Beck, what what the fuck is going on? I don't want to say you suck, but the past recent games, you you've been playing fucking atrocious. I'm not even gonna lie. We got fucking lucky because DJ got injured. I'm pretty yeah. DJ got injured that game. We got lucky that we we got spared. We got saved by the fucking bro. I don't care about his stats. He threw for 300 yards. He went 25 of 40, two touchdowns, three INTs, and a 60 QB. Bro, every time in big games, or it don't even got to be a big game, he's, he, he's an INT machine. He reminds me of Jameis Winston. He's going to throw 30 touchdowns, but he also going to throw 30 interceptions. Bro, I couldn't even watch the game because in the first, it was what, like 13 to 30. I couldn't watch the game. I'm like, for one, it was what? 13 to 3 or some shit or 10 to 3 I forgot I stopped watching because we shouldn't be we shouldn't be trailing to Florida We shouldn't be down to Florida this game Should have been like We should be blowing Florida. I'm not gonna lie to y'all Gators. They got a good team around them. I like DJ Lagway. They got a good team surrounding them But it's fucking the Bulldogs. We should be blowing these niggas out the water, bro And I'm just so So fucking frustrated with this 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 kid, bro, this dude, bro. I'm so frustrated with him because it's like, it's like, what are you doing, bro? Three interceptions, three of them. He did this in the Alabama game. I'm, I gotta look up his stats for the season, bro, because it seems like he eight interceptions. He did it. He did it against um Texas. He did it against Bama. It's like you do you throw three interceptions to Bama. You throw two to Mississippi State. Come on, Mississippi State. They're the worst team in SEC. And you, and three against Texas and zero touchdowns against Texas. And somehow we still get bailed out. And this game, same thing. 30, two touchdowns and three interceptions. It's like, he, at the beginning of the season, I had him in the Heisman race. I had him going in top, top in the draft. He's probably not going round one or round two. Probably round three. I don't know what team will take him because he's an interception. He throws a lot of picks, bro. 15 touchdowns, 8 interceptions, 1,900. Do for pretty much 2,000 yards this season. It's like, bro, you really got to save, bro. It's because DJ Lightweight right now. I'm watching the South Carolina. Oh, my God. Wait, that's a touchdown. Oh, my God. South Carolina, thank you, bro. I need, I need South Carolina to beat A&M so we can get a bye week. And I, I'm like, bro, it's, this dude sucks so bad, bro. I don't want to say, I don't want to call my quarterback ass, but this nigga is terrible, bro. He's been playing horrible football. In the past, I'm going to say the past three games, he's thrown eight interceptions. Past three games, he's thrown eight interceptions. He's thrown eight the past three games. He's thrown more interceptions, actually. I got his stats wrong. So three, six, that's eight, nine, ten. He's thrown eleven interceptions for the season and fifteen touchdowns. Yeah, this nigga is a Jameis Winston. He's gonna give you thirty touchdowns, but he's gonna give you thirty interceptions as well. I'm so bro. It's every time in big games, he's he be selling me. He be selling. Not only that, like I be I, I took a couple of parlays in the beginning of the season. <laughs> I'm never doing that again. Cause it's like you're selling. I think he's throwing more picks. Actually, hold on. Did he? No. First three games, he was solid. But in Bama, Mississippi State, it's like, bro, what are you doing? But we we ultimately won that game. Thank God. I don't want to wish bad on him getting injured, but I'm not happy he got injured. But his injury helped us win because Gators often suck without him. So... That's going to be all for today's video. Um, make sure you guys like the video, subscribe if you're new, and peace out.